Cipher blockchaining, CBC, not allow encryption parallelizable, allow decryption parallelizable, allow random read access, only offers confidentiality. Cipher blockchaining mode of operation are invented the in 1976. The idea of CBC mode is each block of plaintext is exclusive or with the previous ciphertext block before being encrypted. Each ciphertext block depends on all plaintext blocks processed up to that point. To make each message unique, an initialization vector must be used in the first block. Initialization vector is a block of bits that is used by several modes to randomize the encryption, to produce unique ciphertexts, even if the same plaintext is encrypted multiple times. It is important that an initialization vector is never reused under the same key. 64 bits, initialization vector, and, 64 bits, plaintext block, go through th exclusive or operation, produce 64 bits result. The result will produce bit by bit. For example, the first bit of the result will be 1. The second bit of the result will be 0. The third bit of the result will be 0. And the operation will continue for all the remaining bit. After all the remaining bits is done, the result will send to block cipher encryption to produce ciphertext. After that, the first ciphertext is used as the initialization vector for the next operation. The first ciphertext and second plain text go through the exclusive or operation to produce second result. Then the second result will send to the block cipher encryption to produce the second cipher text. The second cipher text is used as the initialization vector for the next operation to produce the third cipher text. The operation will continue until all the plain text have been encrypted into cipher text in CBC mode decryption. The ciphertext is sent to the block cipher decryption to produce a 64 bits result. After that, the result and and 64 bits initialization vector go through th exclusive or operation to produce the 64 bits plaintext. Therefore, the initialization vector must known to both the sender and receiver. The result will produce bit by bit. For example, the first bit of the result will be 1. The second bit of the result will be 1. The third bit of the result will be 0. And the operation will continue for all the remaining bit. Once all the remaining bits is done, the first plaintext is decrypted. Beside, the current ciphertext 1 will be used as initialization vector for the next operation. The ciphertext 1 and the ciphertext 2 result produced by the block cipher decryption will go through the exclusive or operation to generate second plaintext. The second ciphertext is used as the initialization vector for the next operation to generate the third plaintext. The process will continue until all the ciphertext have been decrypted into plaintext. That is all about cipher blockchaining mode.